Hi everyone, this is going to be um, my collection and storage ideas and this would be for more so for someone who has limited amount of space and um, a lot of makeup. So. Um, let's get started. First, I'm going to, um, I bought this shelving unit from, um, Walmart for, um, $30. And, um, I really wanted the Alex drawer system, but it wouldn't fit all of my makeup and I would have had to pay at least double the price of the unit to have it delivered so I just went with this shelving unit so um, first I'm going to start with my palettes and as you can see I have many palettes eyeshadow palettes um, here are my, um, BH Cosmetic palettes. Um, this is the second edition palette. I have all five of them. This is the third edition, the fourth and the fifth. Also, I have some... 88 color palettes. This is the matte shadow palette. This is the cool shimmer palette, which needs to be over on the other side. These are Coastal Scents palettes. This is the 252. This is the 120 palette. Um, warm palette. Um, Metal Mania and more and this is a shanty palette now over here are my um, frost and shimmery shadows um, over here this is a shanty palette this is elf right here LA Colors, Shani, Shani, Profusion, and I believe this is Shani. On the second shelf, I have um, more palettes. Um, this is the Naked 1, 2, and 3. Um, my Too Faced Chocolate Bars, um, a Sephora palette, this right here oh, is my MAC, my new MAC, um, Warm Shadows palette, which is really nice, and, um, these are two palettes that I made up from um, coastal scents. So, here are my, um, foundations. And I have a lot of foundation. This is, um, MAC Face and Body, which I, I like, um, because it's light coverage. Um, Cup Girl Queen 3 and 1, um, BH Cosmetics, um, Black Opal, and this is the Elf, um, BB Cream. This is a Tenant Moisturizer by Elf, um, Infallible Pro. Matte and um, 
Fit Me. I have both formulations of the Fit Me. Um, Makeup Forever. Estee Lauder Double Wear. So I have a lot of foundations. I don't know if I'll ever get through all of them, but I have a lot. So here is just some BH cosmetic brushes and just some other BH cosmetic brushes that I wasn't using that I put in this container. Um, here on the third shelf, there is some tissue, another container with some brushes, um, a mirror in the back, and this is just, um, a gift bag that I thought was really pretty that I kept that some MAC products came in. Now here, this is another um, storage unit that I purchased from Walmart. And then the top are my sponges and um, blenders. And here in the second shelf, that is um, eyeshadows, uh, ColourPop, uh, NYX. These are some samples that um, you get like with a Coastal Scents order. Uh, this is Nika K, Elf, Elf. Um, LA Colors, Coastal Scents, and here are some eye pencils. Here's a Wet n Wild palette that needs to go in the other drawer. And some eye pencils, some um, Nika K shadows. So, yeah. Um... Elf. Uh, this is Elf as well. So, yeah, just some random shadows. In the third drawer is more shadows. Um, this one here <laughs> is so old. Oh my god. I um, purchased this one. I first started wearing makeup. It's by um, Elizabeth Arden. So, yeah. Oh, I can't get it open. So, um, Shadows by Revlon, which I use for um, bases, eyeshadow bases, um, Wet n Wild. Um, black radiance or wet and wild. So, here on the fourth shelf, I have um, more eyeshadow palettes. They're elf palettes. Um, Shani, uh, elf. And Shani, that's a Shani palette. And um, the Coastal Scents uh, Double Stack palette where um, there's eyeshadows on top and blushes on the bottom. Um, more BH Cosmetics, um, Special Occasion. Uh, Day and Night, Jenny Rivera, Party Girl, um, right here, um, Forever Glam, Forever Smoky, Forever Nude, and, um, just some more 
other, you know, shadows that were fashioned after the naked um, palettes. Here are um, some more small palettes. Um, take Me to Brazil. Eyes on the 80. Eyes on the 70. Um, eyes on the 60s. And I just like to keep them in the plastic. Um, here are some elf and um, some go palettes from Coastal Scents and um, some more palettes from BH Cosmetics. So uh, they're baked eyeshadow palettes. So yeah, here I have the smoky palette from Coastal Scents, the Reveal 1 and 2, the Bomb New 2, um, two more from, three more from BH Cosmetics, um, Maybelline Nudes, and Hard Candy, and on the bottom shelf, I just have um, my spa glove to clean my brushes, which really get your brushes clean. Uh, some extra brushes here. My train case and just some hair care products. So that is it for the shelving unit and um, over here is more cosmetics on top is just a hand sanitizer and some q-tips in this drawer are you know pigments um, in this drawer uh, lip liners, they're not organized, as well as my lip glosses, um, the glaze ones from LA Girl, this is um, Wet n Wild, another Wet n Wild, so, and this drawer right here, are all of my bases, excuse me, and this little pill dispenser are my NYX Jumbo Pencil, Depotted, uh, some more pencils that are, you know, for bases, and these are, you know, cream eyeshadows that I use. For bases. In this drawer, just some wipes and um, cleansing cloth and glitter. So, um, yeah, just different glitters. And what I did is that I purchased. Um, glitter from Walmart and took them out of the pack and put them in these little pill containers. So, in this drawer, all of my um, concealers, um, LA Girl, they're still in the plastic because you know, it lets me know that these have not been used. Um, Elf. Pro Long Wear by MAC. There is another Pro Long Wear by MAC. Um, 
This is a little palette that I made up um, from Coastal Scents. And, oh, my cards that I got from ColourPop. They should be in the other drawer. Um, other um, palettes. Concealer palettes. Um, under eye setting powders. This is um, Soft Yellow by MAC. This is another translucent powder by L'Oreal. Um, this is um, a concealer, a HD concealer by e.l.f., um, which is really good for a highlight. My Prep and Prime pen and Bright Forecast by MAC. So, and and this drawer here are is everything for my eyebrows um my spike pencil um concealer my um sigma brow powder this is concealer as well this is my MAC concealer, eyebrow wax from Sigma, um, brow gel from MAC, um, Anastasia dip brow. This is in the color dark brown. Um, this is a brow palette from Coastal Scents so it's you know eyeshadows and here are my um, pencils and and things like that and this next drawer is all of my eyeliners um, here are my gel liners and cream liners, Elf, Sephora, um, Inglot, and I have some more like BH Cosmetics. This is Ruby Kisses, uh, Sephora, and here are all my pencils, my eyeliner pencils and liquid liner so um, this is good eyeliner from um, Maybelline it's a waterproof um, ultra liner and when this it says waterproof it's waterproof just some unopened eye pencils here um, some tape and um, some glitter liners some glitter liners you may notice that I have a pencil sharpener in every drawer <laughs> so this is all my um, mascara and eyelash drawer um, some duo adhesive, um, L'Oreal mascara. So this right here was my favorite mascara, the falsies. So that's really good. This is, um, mascaras that are unopened and container which I keep my um, lashes I have two of them which I keep my lashes and this drawer is all of my blushes um, e.l.f. BH Cosmetic e.l.f. 
and also some palettes. This one is from Coastal Scents, and um, BH Cosmetics, and um, there's another from BH Cosmetics. So I don't have as much blush and this drawer right here is all of my contour powders and creams. Um, this is a concealer by Black Radiance that I use to um, contour with. Um, now I use this um, fit me cream um, foundation to contour my um, contour and effects Con um, contour kit and my shade and lights by Kat Von D and these are um, bronzers and stuff so, um, this is BH Cosmetics, um, powder, pro powder, in the shade 255. Let's see. Oh, I got it open. And that's what it looks like. And which I use for contouring. Um, the Milani. I use this for contouring my nose and another is the MAC Give Me Sun well I can't get that open so uh, okay there we go uh, give me some used to warm up my face and a MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Dark which is too dark for my face so I use it as contour The next drawer are my highlighters. So this is Mary Luminizer and Betty Luminizer, MAC um, Gold Deposit, um, some ALF Hard Candy, my Hourglass um, Ambient Light, in which everybody knows what that looks like. So, not many highlighters. And this drawer is my powders, um, the Infallible um, Pro Mac Powder, um, CoverGirl Mac, um, in medium dark. This is a sample that I got from Sephora Tarte which is a very good um, face powder. Um, I like it. I um, When I finish this, I plan on purchasing the full size. Um, e.l.f. Translucent. Um, e.l.f. High Definition Powder. Back here is my banana powder and other face powders. And this drawer is just, um, this is a body butter by Soap and Glory. This is soap by, um, Shea Moisture. The olive green tea and shea butter, which is hard to find. Um, this is shea butter soap with frankincense and myrrh, which is really, really good, both of them. This is a Clinique eye cream. 
and other samples. This drawer right here is one of my lipstick drawers. I try to keep um, my loose lipstick separated. This is my burgundies and my orange and red drawer. This is um, some lipsticks that I depotted and put in this craft unit. This is my, um, my pink drawer, and also, um, this right here, this little makeup case right here has lipsticks and pencils, and I just grab this when I'm traveling, and more pink lipsticks, um, which are duplicates that of what is already in here, so... Yeah, this is my pink drawer. This is my nude and browns drawer. I have another storage container to depot um, some more lipsticks. And um, it's easy to use when I travel. So I just pick it up and take it with me. But yeah, these are my browns, my golds, my nudes. And in this drawer, it's just extras. Um, brow kit from, um, brow palette, excuse me, from Coastal Scents, MAC Soft Yellow, some e.l.f. Foundations. CoverGirl Queen Foundation. So, yeah, that's just my extra drawer. Uh, here is um, brush cleansers, and back here is alcohol, um, the 91 proof alcohol. So, when I want to spot clean my brushes, that's what I use, and um, here is some other um, basis in which what I go to most. Um, my Prika brush, which is really good, and you see um, some creams, a body butter and um, creams that I use for my feet because I'm diabetic and my feet stay really, really dry. So here are my brushes and um, here are some Sigma brushes and Sedona Lace, my dual fiber brush. Um, Brushes that I use for contour and highlight. Um, pencil brushes. Um, eyeliner brushes. Foundation and concealer brushes. Here is um, my foundation brushes, eye brushes, powder brushes. And here, like my detail brushes. My brow brushes. Here is my fan brushes and um, my lip brushes. So here is an acrylic um, unit with lipsticks. Here, here's my Wet and Wow, my Elf, and I have some Mac in the back. And this is where I keep sponges in a little container. Here are some um, some more lipsticks and it's two containers. Um, my Milani, um, some Nika K, some lip pencils, um, CoverGirl, 
Maybelline here. Back here is where I keep my finishing sprays and my primers. Um, e.l.f. primer. Uh, this is um, Prep and Prime. Um, Urban Decay All Nighter. Um, Avion Water. Tarte um, Primer. Um, Smashbox Primer. Professional. And over here is just where I keep my face wash. Here is a container that I keep all of my um, face powders so it's easy to get to. Um, toner, which is witch hazel. Um, what do you call this stuff? Moisturizer. Moisturizer. And this is what I use to take off my makeup. Um, moisturizer. So yeah, that is about it. So I hope that um, you got some ideas on how to store your makeup when you have limited space and a lot of makeup. So, I thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. <laughs> and if you have any questions or comments or suggestions, leave them in the down bar below and I will get to them. And also, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And I thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.